Is the world ending? A question that's been echoing in the minds of many, fueled by a series of unusual events that have recently shaken our planet. From an unexpected earthquake that jolted the typically calm East Coast to a lightning bolt that dared to strike the Statue of Liberty and a solar eclipse that turned day into night. All these events happening in such a short span of time have left us wondering. Could these events be a sign of the end of times? An earthquake on the East Coast? A rarity? But it happened? That's right. The usually placid, geologically stable East Coast was recently rocked by an earthquake. Now, when we think of earthquakes, our minds typically wander to the West Coast with its famous San Andreas Fault and frequent seismic activity. But this time, it was the East Coast that felt the earth move under its feet. The tremors were felt far and wide. People from all walks of life paused, looked around in surprise, and then, as the ground continued to rumble beneath them, sought shelter. This was no ordinary day. This was a day when the earth itself seemed to wake up. The earthquake, while unexpected, was not unprecedented. The East Coast has seen its fair share of seismic activity in the past, but it's always a surprise when it happens. The magnitude of the quake was substantial, enough to cause buildings to sway and people to take notice. Yet, despite the initial shock and awe, there were no major casualties or widespread destruction. A testament, perhaps, to our resilience and preparedness. The reaction of the people was a mix of surprise, concern and curiosity. Many took to social media to share their experiences, creating a digital chronicle of an event that will be remembered for its rarity. The hashtag East Coast Quake trended for hours with people sharing their personal stories, videos of swaying chandeliers, and even some humor to lighten the mood. But amidst the flurry of tweets and posts, there was a sense of unease, an undercurrent of worry that asked, why is this happening? Is this a sign of something bigger? Earthquakes on the East Coast are rare. Yes, but they're not impossible. They are yet another reminder that our planet is a dynamic, ever-changing entity that doesn't always adhere to our expectations. The earth shook, but we stood firm. Yet, the question lingers, what's next? As we pick up the pieces and resume our daily lives, we can't help but wonder, are we witnessing a series of isolated incidents or are these events part of a larger pattern? Only time will tell, but for now, we remain vigilant, ready to face whatever comes our way. In an electrifying spectacle, lightning struck the Statue of Liberty. This was not just another storm passing over the city, but a moment that left onlookers awestruck and a little uneasy. The timing of the event was uncanny, as the city was just settling into the evening with the iconic silhouette of Lady Liberty against the twilight sky. And then, in a split second, the calm was shattered by an intense bolt of lightning, illuminating the statue and the surrounding harbor in a brilliant flash of light. The public's reaction was a mix of awe and apprehension. Social media was abuzz with images and videos of the electrifying moment some saw it as a rare and stunning display of nature's power, a reminder of the tremendous forces that exist beyond our control. Others, however, perceived this event as something more ominous. To them, the lightning strike was a symbol, a foreboding sign, a warning from the skies. The Statue of Liberty, after all, is more than just a monument. It is a symbol of freedom a beacon of hope, 
and a testament to the enduring spirit of the American people. It has stood tall and steadfast through wars, recessions, and natural disasters, a silent witness to the ever-changing course of history. So, when lightning strikes liberty, it's hard not to wonder if it carries a deeper meaning. But what could this sign be warning us about? Could it be a harbinger of more unsettled times to come? Or simply a freak incident, a coincidence with no deeper significance? The truth is, we may never know, but one thing is certain. That night, the Statue of Liberty stood tall, not diminished, but illuminated by the lightning's flash. It was a sight to behold, a moment that will be etched in the minds of those who witnessed it. The lightning illuminated the night, an unforgettable sight. But the question remains, is it a warning? A ring of fire in the sky, the recent solar eclipse. A spectacle that never fails to captivate, this cosmic event recently graced our skies, visible to the naked eye. The eclipse, a dance between the sun, moon and earth, was visible across the Americas, casting a shadow on the continents for a brief or inspiring moment. The term ring of fire refers to the annular solar eclipse, where the moon is far enough away from the earth to appear smaller than the sun, leaving a blazing ring of sunlight in the sky. It's a sight that has inspired wonder, fear and reverence throughout history. And speaking of history, it's worth noting that solar eclipses have been steeped in myth and superstition from time immemorial. Ancient cultures often interpreted these celestial events as omens, a divine signal of impending change or even the end of the world. The Vikings believed that a wolf was swallowing the sun, while the ancient Chinese thought a dragon was consuming it. In many Native American tribes, the eclipse was seen as a moment of rebirth, a time of renewal. Even in modern times, these myths persist, albeit in a more metaphorical sense. The solar eclipse has been likened to a cosmic reset button, a moment of reflection and introspection, a signal for us to pause and reconsider our place in the universe. But despite these beliefs, it's essential to remember that a solar eclipse is a natural astronomical event, a ballet of celestial bodies in the vast cosmic stage. It's a reminder of our place in the universe, a humbling spectacle that underscores our existence's transience and beauty. The sun disappeared, if only for a moment, but the question still echoes. Is it a signal? So, is the world ending? As we've seen, recent events have been dramatic indeed. An earthquake on the relatively calm east coast a lightning bolt striking the Statue of Liberty and a solar eclipse creating a ring of fire in the sky. However, as unsettling as these phenomena may be, they remain just that, natural phenomena. They are not necessarily harbingers of an apocalypse, but reminders of the dynamic and unpredictable nature of our world. The world keeps turning and life goes on. But one thing is certain, we live in interesting times.